Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Rosie and I create videos on travel, photography and lifestyle. So in today's video it's actually a vlog from a week or two ago. Um, I was about to edit the footage and I realised that I hadn't done an intro or outro so I'm going to do that now. So excuse the wet hair and no makeup. Anyway, um, in today's vlog I actually went to a yoga class to photograph it um, in a gorgeous, gorgeous place. I'll show you that in the video. Um, and then I went to a dog meetup, so that'll also be after the yoga, so stay tuned for that, lots of cute doggies, and I'll talk to you at the end. So I'm here at a huge, like, multi-million dollar mansion <laughs> in the middle of Miami, uh, well, Miami Beach, um, photographing some universal yoga from the guy who founded it. They're doing a retreat here for 10 days, and today's the last day, so I've come along just to get some photographs of them practicing. Um, so that's really awesome. I'll show you around because it's insane, like absolutely insane. And then I'm going to go home and then this afternoon I'm going to a dog meetup which is also part of my dog photography business. Um, so I'll be able to talk you through that as well and why I do it and what I do and how it helps and everything else. So I'll show you around because it's absolutely crazy. Like I can't, I always see this building and lots of other multi-million dollar buildings on the bus to and from South Beach. And I never thought I'd actually step foot in one of these buildings, but to be here like photographing and invited here and feel at home, it's just amazing. But I'll show you around and you'll see what I mean. So this is the driveway and then there's a tennis court obviously <laughs> um, and then this is the mansion I mean I'm just about to go inside. I don't know if I'll be able to talk because I might be practicing yoga or I think the guy will be talking. Um, but I'll show you around. goodness that yoga was insane 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 
but yeah, just about to leave. I thought I'd give you one last little look at this beautiful, beautiful house. Oh my God. How gorgeous. Then the water behind us. Ugh, beautiful. Just got home and back to Alice. Hi. Hi. Are you half asleep? Are you half asleep? Oh my god, look at that face. <laughs> Alice. Hi. So I just got home from this morning's yoga, which was crazy. Like, I feel a little bit lost for words just because like the practice was hard, the teacher was firm, <laughs> not strict, I would say firm, like he kind of, he was good, he was good. Um, the venue was insane, literally, I have no idea how much that apartment, that house must cost, but it must be like 20 million, 30 million, 50 million, something, something million. Um, but it was beautiful, I'm grateful that I was able to go there and take some photographs and meet them and and witness it as well and also go to this place because like I always see it on the bus I don't even mention this I always see it on the bus to and from South Beach so to be able to actually be in that house and like yeah it's crazy crazy anyway it's 11.40 I just got home and I need to have a quick shower because I'm sweaty from all the sweaty people sweating around me sweat 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 so I'm gonna have a shower um, and then I need to head off soon to go to nightlife brewing so i'm going to a meetup today it's a golden's meetup and because jerome was not here i need to get there a little bit earlier so i've got time to set up and get everything organized and um, but i'll take you along for that as well um and then probably when i get home i'll talk to you a little bit more about why i'm going to this and what it does for my business and how it helps and things in case anyone's interested <sighs> i'm exhausted from watching them do on all that yoga like all i did was stand around and take photographs and i'm exhausted because it just looks so tiring, so hard, impossible. Like they were twisting in all different places. I'll insert some photographs and some videos so you can see what I mean, but it was crazy. Okay, time for a shower and then food and then I'm going out again. <laughs> right, I have showered <clears throat> and eaten and changed into my doggy t-shirt. Um, I'm just about to go to the dog meetup, so I'll show you just what I bring with me and then I'll show you over there what I actually have. Um, so I always take a fold-up table, which is the white one, a big frame, t-shirts and a bag, and then a suitcase. And I also need to actually take my two tripods. I forgot them. One second. So actually, on second thoughts, so usually I bring two tripods with me, and that's where I hang the big photo from. But actually, I've already got enough to carry, and I think I'll be able to display it when we're there, like on the seats or on the windowsill or something. So I'm going to not bother. So I've got the suitcase, the bag... A huge frame and a table and probably even the table I probably didn't need to take but I will take it anyway. Hmm. Anyway, um let's go, I'll see you there. So I just wanted to talk to you a little bit about the dog meetup and why I go to them and what happens and who organises it and all these kind of things. So, um, as you probably know, I started dog photography last February and then it was in last, it was about last May time that I got invited to my first dog meetup. Um, I didn't really know what to expect or what it was. But anyway, I went along and shared a table with another vendor. Um, and actually it's just basically dogs all getting together with different vendors selling their products. Um, yeah, and that's kind of the gist of it. So, um, the one that I went to today was organised by the Goldens of Miami, um, and, <coughs> sorry, I'm a little bit ill, um, and we went to a brewery in Miami, which is just next to the Marlins Park, I believe, it's one of the sports, <laughs> sports arenas, I'm not into sports, anyway, um, 
so yeah we just there was a couple of vendors there and we go along and set up a table um with our products that we sell and just talk to everyone that's there basically so i was there obviously with my photography um there was somebody there selling cakes and biscuits and treats and things somebody else selling cbd products um somebody selling bandanas and um like starbucks cups um so yeah, it's a great way to meet local vendors and other vendors selling different things and it's also a great way to meet our um, potential clients so obviously the people like to get together so that they can make friends with the dog owners the dogs love to play together but it's also great for them to meet us like different vendors are in and around Miami in the area and it's great for us to go as vendors to meet our clients so we obviously go there set up the table and people come around and talk to us and look at what we're selling um, and yet it's also a great way to get email addresses and just basically for people to meet us because a lot of the time I find that people follow me on Instagram but then they don't quite know who I am so they will meet me at an event that's generally when they book in a photo shoot. So I've actually started organising my own meetups as well called Pints and Poochies, it's on Instagram, um, in and around Miami. Um, I'm thinking about doing separate videos to why I do that and how I set it up and what I do to organise the events. Um, so let me know in the comments below if you think that's something you'd be interested in knowing about. Um, but yeah, so that's all from today. Thank you so much for watching. I'm sorry about the <laughs> appearance and also I've just put in some new braces. I think I might do a video on that as well. So I'm kind of lisping a little bit because they're a bit in pain. Anyway, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!